This is some particular anatomy on the premolar, maxillary premolars that I really want to highlight. So if you can see the tooth, two roots for the maxillary, and you notice interproximally there are some uh, fossas, right? You can kind of see that down. And it's kind of fascinating because there's not a lot of calculus on the straight facials right here. There's not a lot, but right in those fossas, that deep area, this one has a big bump. There is calculus on there. So what's really good for this area? A mini, a mini instrument, left and right for your ultrasonic. But you're just really going to roll and adapt more than you would think just to get in that groove. Because if you looked at this on the x-ray, you wouldn't be able to tell, right? But if we roll just a bit, we can see how deep that little indent is. So maxillary premolars, especially towards the mesial, you really want to roll those guys uh, and get in that dip. Okay, so I also know we'll get a lot of questions on this root. So this obviously, as it was being extracted, broke. So the root tip after that was taken out surgically and it wasn't left in the patient's skull. So that usually, this is a typical root fracture as an extraction was happening, which makes sense. There's not a big decay. I mean, it's just kind of a bummer that this nice thick root uh, was in the skull and then it broke as it came out.